Hi, Lupi Voss here. I am going to show you how to place a foil on the side of your client's head without hurting your body and making it um, not slip out. How about that? So what I've got here on our mannequin is we have a seven section. This is the seven section that is done for anyone who has hair that's longer than their chin. This is hair, how hair naturally falls. So let's go through this real quick. We'll section her in quarters, so we'll go from ear to ear, um, take her natural part directly through the back all the way down. Starting in the back, we'll take our triangle out, up, tie it up, tie it up, tie it up. We've got our three done in the back pretty fast. And then from the recession back to where the triangle is, tie it up, tie it up. And then we'll mirror on the other side um, from where the triangle is to recession and then tie these two up. A subsection is a subsection. It's what you do within these subsections that will give you the effect for your guests. So we're ready to start placing our foils on the side of the head. So one of the challenges of doing a hairline foil is our guests are up straight. So whenever we're trying to put the foil in, we get really awkward and we have to take care of our body. Team, this is what's gonna happen. They're only gonna be in the chair for a few minutes and being in this position. It's easier for us to put a foil in that's nice, tight, and secure and won't slip out when we're working horizontally. So we need to get her as horizontal as we possibly can. So this is what I'm going to tell our um, model today is, I'm going to ask Sarah to gently put her ear to her left shoulder and then put her chin down. So uh, Sarah, let's put your ear to your left shoulder and then put your chin down. So while she is in this position, what's going to happen is I'll stand right in front of her and it's going to be a lot easier for me to place this foil. So let's grab our pin tail. Here we are. So I'll take a really fine parting because of the change in her um, hairline. I'll take my first parting on this side here. Let's clip this hair back. Move it up and out of the way. And then Take your weave effect, however you want to take your weave effect. We'll, we'll do an ultra fine weave in through here. Take this hair out. If she wants to have her hair bright in her inspiration picture, if it's really, really bright, then we would be placing the foil here. But she wants it a little bit of shadow, so I'm going to place the foil here. Pull the hair away, place it on the foil, smooth that out. Let's grab some of your product, apply it to the hair. Make sure it's nice and saturated. Roll the hair back and forth. So now we'll just fold our foil up. I'm going to grab some of that enlightener and push it up to the root. Again, around the hairline. What you want to do is make sure these are short foils, meaning fold it up once, fold it up again. And here's a little tip to make sure I'll work nice and slow. This will help secure your foils. It almost locks it inside. So you can see there's a little lip that happens right there. Slide it across, and I would suggest only to lock in one side, don't lock in the second side because it's gonna take a long time to get that foil out. And then let's go again on this side. So now that Sarah's hair, head is um, to her ear, and I am able to get in there and work horizontally, I can actually get these foils in a little bit tighter. So we'll do an ultra weave. Again, move that hair out of the way. Place our foil, lift the hair up, drop it down with some tension, push out that any type of lift that's at the foil to help you get really close. Put your product on. Keep adding as you go. If you notice, my brush is horizontal and I'll bring it vertical so I can make sure I'm rolling that product into the hair gently. 
And um, one tip that I will give you, I'm pushing the foil to the head as I'm working. You can almost see it starting to buckle a little bit. That way, while I'm applying, I'm not pulling the foil away. So, and the same thing here, as I'm bending the foil, I'm, I'm pushing the foil close to the head. I'm going to push some of that enlightener up to the root. Take your fold, take your foil and fold it in half again. Put your teeth right where the hair is. Stick your hand underneath. Push up into the teeth to lock that foil in. And then we have our side foils. And you can keep working two or three foils back to back. And then when you have her put her chin up, you can see how nice and tight these are. And then just simply clip all this hair back and let her read her magazine. Here we go. So this is our side foils. Make sure when you're placing your foils, get her head as horizontal as she can possibly be, comfortably, and then with her chin down, and you'll be able to get in there without hurting your body. Have fun weaving.